We are now at part C of question 3 of the May 2024 CSET Mathematics paper. What it says here is that the diagram below shows a shape T and its image Q after a transformation. Alright, so you have T and you have Q. Describe fully the single transformation that maps T onto the shape Q. Alright. Let's see what happens here. Suppose you have a line going this way. You can see what's going on here. Maps T onto Q. It's a reflection in this line. Because if you consider this green line here as your mirror line, right? You reflect T, what you would see is Q, right? You flip T over, you get Q. So you can clearly see some mirror, a mirror line there. So, the thing now, all right, what you would write is that <coughs> T is mapped onto Q by a reflection in the line and you have to state what line it is what's the equation of this line well, you can see here that it is the line y equals x right this is the line y equals x when x is 1 y is 1 x y equals 2 x equals 2 y is 3, x is 3, right? y equals x. So that is the um, single transformation there. It says, on the, on the diagram above, draw the image of shape T after it undergoes a translation by a vector negative 1, 6 and label it M. Oh, wait, where, where? Okay, yeah. We're at the last part of question three. Nice. Question three is done. Aha, <laughs> nice, nice. But anyway, we're not done it. We have to do this part. So, <coughs> draw the shape of T after it was a translation by this vector. Remember now, when it comes to translation, it's in the form x, y. So in this case, x is negative 1, y is 6. Remember, x is horizontal, goes left to right. If it is positive, it goes to the right. If it's negative, it goes to the left. This negative 1 means 1 unit to the left that's this negative one here and this six means y remember y goes up for positive and down for negative six means six you're going to move six units up it's positive so it's up if the one was positive here it would be 1 to the right, but since it's negative, it's 1 to the left. If this 6 was negative, it, won. it would be 6 units down, but since it's positive, it's 6 units up. So negative 1, 6. So the translation vector is negative 1, 6. Now, what they want you to do is find the image of T and call it M. So every point on T will move. So you see, this point here, it would move. All right, so this point first, one to the left, and one, two, three, four, five, six up. So that point would be 
hair. You see this point, it move one to the left and one, two, three, four, five, six up. So it will end up here. This point here, go one to the left and one, two, three, four, five, six up. So we move here. This point here, it will move up. one to the left and one, two, three, four, five, six up. So it will end up here. So let's draw join these, join the points to get our shape. Alright, and that is what we call M. See that? Mm -hmm. So, that is the end of question 3.